Hi everyone, welcome to Mathematically Inclined. I am super excited to share this formula with you. It says find the number of terms in the given binomial expansion. It's huge. And if you try expanding one by one by taking the pairs, which is the conventional method, I am sure you'll go crazy. So let's check out how we can do that in five seconds. Let's get started. So first shall give us the answer. Yes. Second. That's it. And the last one. Yes, that's it. It is that simple. Want to know the magic formula? Let's get started. Please have a look at this formula. Suppose we are given k number of terms to the power n. So number of terms in this case would be n plus if there are k terms here, so k minus 1, c k minus 1. That's it. That means we are using the combination formula which was ncr is equal to n factorial upon r factorial into n minus r whole factorial. If you have, if you are very quick in solving this, then at times this question doesn't even take 5 seconds. So, if I run you through all the parts one more time, so for the first one, as you can see, there are four terms irrespective of whatever sign they have, plus, minus, it could be anything. So k is 4, that means the number of terms. This power is 6. That's it. So this would be 6 plus k minus 1, that's 3. C k minus 1, that's 3 again. So all you are doing is calculating 9c3. And if you know the quickest way to find this, you would realize this is nothing but 9 into 8 into 7 and this is 3 factorial which is 3 into 2 into 1. Please note I have already cancelled 6 factorial in the numerator and the denominator. On solving this we get the answer as 84. Similarly, for the second one, as you see, the number of terms are 3. So, k is 3, n over here is 10. So, all you need to do is 10 plus k minus 1. That gives us 12. So, 12, c, 2. This would be 12 into 11 by 2, which is simply your 66. Please note, I am using very quick method to find your NCR also. If you do not follow, let me know in the comment section below. I can make a separate video for the same. Moving on to the third one. As you see, this time there are 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 terms. And this 20 is N. So, N plus K minus 1. So, 20 plus K minus 1 would give me 4. So, 24 C4. And then one more time, all I am doing is solving it as 24 into 23 into 22 into 21 upon 4 factorial which gets cancelled. The only time which you would require is to multiply these which can again be do in a very quick manner. So the answer is 10626. I hope you followed the same. Please have a look. So if you followed this formula, then I have a little do it yourself for you. Yes, please try out this question and give your answers in the comment section below. And if you like the trick, make sure to share it with the people around you. Give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for many more math videos. Also, do check out the playlist on my channel for many more math shortcuts and many more math full concepts. See you with the next video real soon. Until then, bye-bye.